Hi everyone, Aaron here for Zolotech, and I wanted to show you how to unlock the LG G4. This is the latest from LG, and this one's actually locked to AT&T. You can see here, G4, and I haven't even taken the wrapper off it, but this is the G4 locked to AT&T, and that means I can't use it worldwide or on any other carrier. We're gonna use the unlockingcompany.com, but before we do that, we need to get a little bit of information from here, and that's the IMEI number. So to do that, we wanna to go to the dialer, so you find the dialer, and then on just about any phone, it's the same. It's star pound zero six pound, and it will pop up the IMEI. Once you have this number, you'll need to go over to their website, theunlockingcompany.com, and put this in. And let me show you that now. Once you're at theunlockingcompany.com, you need to select your phone manufacturer. So in this case, it's LG. Then we need to select our phone model. And in this case, it's the LG G4. So we're going to scroll down until we find that. And you can see there's a couple different options, but we want the LG G4 unlock code. Then we're going to click on get unlocking code. Once we're at this part of the website, we've got a couple different things we need to do still. We need to select the country we purchased it from. In this case, it's the United States, but you can see there's quite a few options. And then we need to select our carrier. In this case, it's AT&T. And here is where we put in that code that we got from before. So we're going to put this code in. Now, in some cases, we need to delete those last couple numbers. We'll click on Get Unlocking Code, and it will bring us to the next screen. Now, in here, we simply pay for the unlock code. And what will happen is once they have the code, they'll email it to us. And once we have the email, that will have our unlock code within it. I've powered off the phone now so that I can swap the SIM card. Now you'll need to grab a SIM card from the carrier you want to switch to, or really any non at and carrier in this case will work. That will just allow us to enter the unlock code. So you can get any SIM card from another carrier and you'll be able to do that. So we're going to pop the back off, then we're going to pop the battery out, and then we're going to remove this SIM card. Now this is a little bit tricky to get in here, so I'll just use a little tool to, to help it along here a little bit. Once we have our AT&T SIM card out, we can grab a different carrier. Now I have a nano SIM and a little bit of an adapter here uh, with a T-Mobile SIM card. So we can use this to unlock the phone. I've got the SIM card in place. I'll put the battery back in, put the back cover on, and then we'll boot the phone. You can see it's still an AT&T phone, but we'll be able to use it on any GSM carrier worldwide. So let's go ahead and unlock it. And before I even unlocked it, you can see it says network locked, SIM network unlock pin, unlocked attempt one of 10. So once you get that unlock email from the unlocking company, what you'll need to do is place the unlock code here. Now you only have 10 attempts, so be very careful or this will permanently lock. So we'll go ahead and put in the code. Once we have the code in place, we'll simply hit unlock. It says SIM network unlock successful. Now we can use this on any carrier. So give it just a moment, it's going to reboot and we'll be able to actually use this phone on any carrier. And it may take a moment to actually reboot and do what it needs to do. The phone has rebooted and you can see it says T-Mobile. We have 4G LTE and a few bars here and it's permanently unlocked now. You can use it on any GSM carrier worldwide and it will stay unlocked. So let me show you that it works. I've actually opened a browser here. I have my website, but let's go back. We're not on Wi-Fi or anything. Let's scroll down and we'll go to this video. You'll see it'll load. We can scroll, it's nice and fast. We'll go to the next one, my LG G4 review. So nice and fast, works really well. No problems there, and it's permanently unlocked. So I use the unlockingcompany.com. I'll leave a link to them in the description below. And if you have any other questions or comments, let me know in the comments below. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. As always, thanks for watching. This is Aaron. I'll see you next time.